Hey loves, welcome back to my channel. So I am back with another video. Today I'm doing a lip swatch video featuring the Demi Matte Liquid Lipsticks from Primark. So guys, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, hit that subscribe button if you haven't done so already, and leave me a comment below, let me know what some of your favorite colors are. So guys, I don't have any lipstick on my lips at the moment, and I'm going to be trying on and swatching all 16 shades of the Demi Matte Liquid Lipstick. So they come in packs of four guys. So they have the Rose Edit, they also have the Bright Edit, they have the Peach Edit, and they also have the Nude Edit, which I've been wearing day to day. Um, they are quite small, guys, but I find that they're really handy for popping into your hand luggage and also just into your makeup bag as well. Um, they say that they're demi-matte, but I actually find that they're full matte, um, but they just don't have that drying effect, which I really like. So guys, let's just get straight on into trying these um, liquid lipsticks out. unfortunate thing with these um liquid lipsticks is that each individual one doesn't actually have a color or a number on it so you don't really know what shade it is you just know what edit it's from so the first pack that i'm trying is the nude edits guys and i'm also going to try on this color here it's kind of like a nude um kind of like light coffee or mocha color so guys it doesn't seem like there's that much product inside each of these liquid lipsticks but let's go ahead and try on this first color here and guys i haven't lined my lips or anything like that i'm just literally trying these on but my first impressions are definitely that they're nice and creamy they have a good coverage as well but I definitely already know that this shade is not for me. But I think for someone who was maybe a different shade or had different undertones to me, this colour is definitely going to be really nice. But I like the way that it's gone on really smoothly. It doesn't feel drying at all to the lip. So that is this colour here, guys. So guys, that is the first shade tried on. I've just taken it off with a face wipe. It wasn't too difficult to remove at all. And like I said, I liked the way that it felt on my lips. The texture was really nice. But I just feel like for a different shade, that colour will be absolutely perfect. So sticking with the nude edit, I'm now moving on to try a different colour. So I'm going on to this shade here, guys. So let's just give that a try and see what it looks like. <laughs> try it on this pinky shade first wow this is like a neon pink
guys, that is the end of the Brights edit. It definitely lives up to its name. A lot of the shades within that edit are very bright. I didn't particularly like the first shade. It was a little bit too fluorescent pink for me. And you definitely had to build up a few layers before you got the true colour. Um, I do like the ready shade. And especially this shade that I'm wearing right now. I just think that those tones definitely suit me a lot more. So guys, let's move on into the peach edit. So guys, I've just taken off my lipstick from the Brights range, the one that I was just wearing last, and there has been a little bit of staining. Nevertheless, I am going to move on to the first colour from the Peach Edit, which is this colour here. that is the end of the peach edit and I have to say it's a definite no from me I felt that a lot of the colors within the edit were very very similar to one another also none of the colors seem to suit my skin tone um, and I also found that you had to apply a good few layers of the liquid lipstick before you actually got the true color out of it so like I say if you're of a different skin tone from myself it may very well suit you and also guys these liquid lipsticks were four pounds so if you wanted to give them a go definitely worth a try but anyways let's move on to the final edit which is the rose edit so guys the first color from the rose edit is this one here so let's give this one a go So guys that is the end of the rose edit there are definitely a few more colors within that edit that i like and that suit my skin tone so i would definitely say to give it a go and um, there were a few colors within that edit that again needed a few more than one application before you got the true color out of it but like i said this was four pounds guys and definitely worth a try so guys my overall opinion of the demi matte liquid lipsticks from primark is that they are definitely worth a try so you get a pack of four for four pounds 
and like I said some of them have actually been reduced to two pounds for a pack of four so they're definitely reasonably priced for what you get um, I would definitely say that I like some of the colors within the edits they're definite hits um, and of course like I said earlier some of them are misses but that's merely because they don't suit my skin tone or my complexion I especially like that they are demi matte so they're not very drying on the lips and I also really like the applicator that comes with the liquid lipsticks now there is some transfer from some of the liquid lipsticks but again that's probably because of the demi matte element so overall for me it's a definite thumbs up I definitely recommend it for anybody who's maybe just trying to start off incorporating color into their you know makeup routine and especially for their lipsticks um, and also they're very handy to pop into you know your purse when you're going on a night out or like I say for traveling um, so it's a definite thumbs up for me and like I said reasonably priced for what they are so guys that is the end of this video I hope that you enjoyed me trying on some of these liquid lipsticks if you did please don't forget to give it a thumbs up hit that subscribe button and I will see you in my next video